So I'm just going to go ahead and place some orders. This is a YM chart uh, using our ATM template pack. And if you do need that, it is absolutely free. You can get it at our website, xcbcdtrading.com. Uh, no catches. You might stumble across some other products that you might like, though. But uh, the ATM template pack is absolutely free. Uh, oh, that was an RTY alert. So we're going to have a look at that one as well. Now, these are also going to use our ATM packs. So I'll be back to explain that right after this. Okay, so this trade is going to have three orders attached to it and there's going to be an automatic stop and target that's placed once it does get filled. We actually did another video on feature requests in which case we requested that uh, stops and targets be displayed even though it's not filled but maybe like in a different opacity or something that would identify them as pending uh, or possible pending orders if it was filled. Now back to our YM chart here. And you see that the stuff was automatically moved to break even as we were looking at the RTY chart. Now that is a stop management move and that is part of our template pack if you wanted to see how that worked. All these template packs, we assume that you're gonna modify for your own needs, um, but they're definitely a great starting point to help you out. Now, of course, this is a 100 tick chart, so it's going to be very quick. And you can imagine that uh, ETM moves or automatic trade management uh, systems in your trades would definitely help with that uh, quickness that you must react uh, in order to move stops to break even. So we're just going to wait this one out and hopefully it gets down there or we get taken out at our break even point. Now, the other way this hopefully goes is towards our target. We're actually not too far from it. Uh, the buy limit, you can see there's just as many orders as what our stop is. So you could scale out if you wanted to, but just to kind of give you an idea on how this works on a short-term trade and how that ATM pack could prove to be useful. So get that. It's totally free. XABCDtrading.com. Now this pattern that came up we're at the top of the reversal, this is not an RTP2 pattern and you see that almost all the legs are blue. We could move this down to a uh, 100 tick chart, which would probably look better and allow us to move our trades in a little bit faster. This is a 300 tick. You can see that we place our order right at the top of the back side of that reversal. Uh, the stop could even be stretched out a little bit to make sure that it's above that resistance level. But uh, depending on how you want to do it, you can do it many different ways. Uh, the target was set as a two to one risk versus reward as a minimum. So at least uh, something that's going to be twice as big as what the stop is. And now it's just a matter of waiting. Now, if you watch carefully, you saw that stop get moved automatically. You can go ahead and rewind the video if you want to see it again. That is automatically done. It happens very quickly. Now, it is a 300 tick chart. So, again, it is probably useful to have something like that in there. Um, but it's totally up to you if you want to have an automated move to break even. It could be helpful, especially if you had to step away from the machine and you needed something to manage the order in the meantime. So there's a bunch of different ways you can move stops to break even depending on what you're trying to accomplish. Um, so if you are interested in stuff like that, we do have a lot of education on that uh, on our site. But uh, if you are waiting to see what would happen here, it's just a matter of time before we either get out at break even, in which case we'll look for something else or we end up hitting that target. But definitely uh, as a 300 tick chart uh, or 100 tick chart, these short term Trades are probably not going to be held for as long as something uh, that you might trade on more like a 15 or 30, obviously, but uh, it is something that is going to happen very quickly. So if you're not just staring at the chart ready to click, um, and even then still uh, ETM orders can be much faster than that, it might be to your advantage to use something like that. So at this point, I'm just going to wait this one out and see which way it goes. Um, at a certain point, there's there's not going to be a whole lot that you can actually do to manage the trade. You'll just have to wait it out. Um, you'll notice that in these tick chart videos, there's a lot of targets that are relatively early, but they're still hitting their minimum of a two to one. So you could move them down. You'll be in the trade longer. Um, again, pros and cons to that as well. But uh, it is something that you, you can, if you're looking for quick little targets, you can still do with a decent two to one risk or support. So it looks like we're just about to hit it. A bit more here. 
and we'll wrap up this video hopefully a couple trades that you guys have seen on the shorter term time frames as we often get requests for that so um, if you do have any questions about these atm packs or anything to do with the patterns feel free to reach out to us we also have a little live chat on our website, xabctrading.com. All right, and you thought the video was over. No, this is another one that just came out. This is actually an FX pair. Uh, this is a Kiwi Swissy again, a 300 tick chart, different market. Played the same way using the ATM packs, and we're looking for this to come up a little bit higher. I'm just gonna let this record, and we'll try fast forwarding that in post so that we don't have to sit here for an hour or two. Uh, even though the 300 tick chart is a fast moving chart, especially moving orders in at the beginning, uh, they can take some time to play out, especially if things start going your way. Okay, so what we're gonna do now that we had this bullish pattern appear, we were short, we had this bullish one appear. Uh, very common to see that after your initial move goes your way, uh, in which case it can be a great sign to move stops to break even. But in this case, what we're gonna do is we're gonna close out this existing short. Let me just get these ATMs all figured out here. And then we're gonna open up a, a long position going the opposite way. So we're just gonna let it kind of flip and rip. And let's see if we can do this we're just gonna close this one out here this order we were short that looks good and we're in that reversal area let me just pick up my ATMs and we'll also yeah I think that's okay we'll go with this one and attach our stop strategy that looks good and buy. see it helps to do this relatively quickly especially if you're on these smaller term charts now this tool that you're seeing me drives our position tool, helps me figure out what my two to one is, uh, risking a certain percentage of the account. Uh, we're gonna be able to figure out, based off the stops and tar targets that we drew in, uh, how much we should be able to risk and all that good stuff. So that's what that tool is that you see there with the, the red highlight areas and then the different green zones. That's gonna represent my risk versus award. And we're just gonna let this one now play out. So this entire trade at this point was almost about four hours long, which is very rare for a 300 tick chart. But at this point, we'll move stops to break even and we will wait to see what happens. But hopefully that kind of shows you how these ATM orders work and we'll see you in the next video.